What's going on everybody? It's Tian here. Now, a long time ago, maybe a year or so ago, I made a video on transferring music from your Apple devices back to your Windows computer, and I did promise a Mac version. Now, I'm sorry about the delay, but here it finally is. So today I'm gonna to be showing you how to transfer music from your Apple devices, and in this demo, I'm gonna be using my iPhone 5, and I'm gonna be transferring all that music back to my Mac. Now, the software that we're gonna be using today is called Sanuti. Now, Sanuti offers a free trial and a, uh, a paid license as well. The free trial allows you to use it for 30 days or 1,000 songs, and I feel that's probably gonna be enough for about most of my viewers. Um, and then if you want to remove those limitations, of course, you can go ahead and purchase it for uh, $18.99. Now, once you have that application downloaded, you want to go ahead and plug in your device, and then you want to go ahead and open the application. So here I have opened up, um, and so basically right here is your device, and all these playlists down here are your iTunes playlists. They're not on your phone, but they're on your they're in your iTunes application, and those are all the playlists. And I have a lot of Indian music because it's my dad's iTunes. Anyways, I'm gonna be transferring music from my phone right here. So you can, if you wanna do a quick transfer and just transfer every single song on your device, you wanna just go to library and then hit command A to select all your songs and then go ahead and hit transfer. Now what I'm gonna do for this demo is I'm gonna be just choosing, choosing one song. So let's say I want No Sleep by Wiz Khalifa, I'm gonna go ahead and hit transfer. And you can see the transfer was, uh, was done really quickly. Of course, with more songs, it's gonna take a little bit longer. Um, so now I have the music downloaded to my folder. By the way, in Sanuti, if you go up here and click on Preferences, you can select where you want your music to download to. So by default, I have it uh, in my Alox Music folder. So now you're done with that. The music is done transferring, and all my music is in this folder. Don't worry about the file format. It's gonna come out either MP3 or M4A. Both formats work just fine. Um, in iTunes. So next thing you want to do, you want to transfer this music that you just imported from your iPhone and you want to go ahead and put it back into iTunes. So in iTunes, I'm going to create a new playlist um, for my own. I'm going to call it Niggas in the Car 13 because that's what it is on my iPhone. And I'm just going to go to my music uh, folder and hit Command A, select all the songs and just drop it right in. And you can see iTunes begins to process all the music. Once it's done processing, I'll be right back. It's all done processing. I just got music from my Apple device, my iPhone 5, back to my computer for free. I have the trial edition. So that's it, guys. That's how you transfer music from your Apple device to your Mac and your Mac's iTunes, of course. Um, Again, sorry for the delay for this video, but if you enjoyed it, please let me know down below in the comments. Please go hit the like button. Please go subscribe. This all really helps me out a lot and helps me create more videos like these. I mean, I'm on vacation and I'm still, you know, creating videos for you guys. So likes and subscribe uh, subscriptions help out a lot. And I'll catch you guys in the next video. See ya.